Hey guys, this is Super Review Show here. Um, Bill Murray is going to make a cameo. Well, he, it's not really specified if it's a cameo or not. But he's going to make an appearance in the new Ghostbusters reboot. Now, whether he's playing Vankman or if he's playing a, like a clerk at a store with, with when Melissa McCarthy walks in, we don't know. But this could be... If, if he is playing Venkman, that would acknowledge the history of the past two films and stuff. Because I don't really want that, though. I want a fresh take, though. I'd rather see a fresh take than a recontinuing story, to be honest. At this point in the game, I'm like, you know what? I'm ready for the reboot. I'm ready for this. They're dropping the summer blockbuster season next year. Can't wait any longer. Holy crap, can't wait. Um, now, but another thing is, Dan Aykroyd has confirmed that he will make a cameo. He's been enthusiastic about a new, a new Ghostbusters film forever. Like, literally since Ghostbusters 2. I'm not even joking when I say it. It's like, Ghostbusters 3, we're going on right now. Every year, every like month or so, he's like, oh yeah, we're doing this next month. And then, mm, that doesn't happen. So, luckily he's been very enthusiastic about, it. enthusiastic about this new Ghostbusters film. He's very happy about it. And sooner or later, we'll, we'll see it. We'll judge it on its own merits. See if Paul Feig's taste works. I believe it's going to work. I believe it's going to make a, not a lot of money, but I think it'll make a lot of money. Um, like not like billions of dollars, maybe like in the three or four hundred million dollar range, somewhere around there, to work on a sequel, to go from there and build out a Ghostbusters universe, kind of like Dan Aykroyd wants the whole time, except without the continuation of his films. That's okay. But um, yeah, so what I would think about this Bill Murray cameo situation would be that if you have Bill Murray... As at, least, at least a cameo. That's cool. But if you actually utilize him as a Peter Vankman, that's a different story. Because that, that, that does acknowledge the history of the past two films. I mean, for all I know, he could just be a cameo. For all I know, he could be Peter Vankman. Who knows? But um, please, jump in the comment section. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. I'd love to see if you... What do you guys think about this? Could he be Vankman? Or could he be just a random dude on the street saying, I don't believe in, in ghosts. You know, something like that. But, um, yeah, for all your Ghostbusters updates, though, keep it locked on the Superview Show. I'll see you later.